All right, after breakfast, we took our hike up back to the village, about two, two and a half miles, um, and we learned something. So for those of you that are interested in maybe utilizing the helicopter services, the helicopters regularly run from Friday through Mondays, and then it's hit and miss if they run any other time beyond that. However, the mules, I think they run every single day. So now we are back at the 50 foot waterfall and it is time to jump in it, to get wet, to get cold. Just gotta find our way to the base. Okay, now it's time to figure out how I get over to the waterfall. Find yourself a nice little sand bank. Help me put up my zipper? Yeah. Oh, this is awesome. Whoa. It's time to walk into the waterfall. Ow, that hurt. I just walked through that torrential waterfall and just pelted my head. There you have it. That was 50 foot waterfall. The first major waterfall you come to as you hike through the canyon. We're here, it's the end of February. These wetsuits are definitely appreciated. All right, we are exploring the top of Little Navajo Falls. Oh, that's scary. Don't fall off to your right. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's so scary. <laughs> The object right now is to get to that pool. We want to go dunk in that. Now let's go check the edge of this pool. Just chilling here at the top of Navajo Falls. <laughs> Don't mind us. This is so cool. I like to call this one the, the hanging garden cave. Got all these little ferns. All right, it's time to go play in that mother of a waterfall. In that blue turquoise yeah. water. Dude, this just looks like heaven. Oh my goodness. There are all sorts of little caves and springs coming through here. There you go, there's a unique picnic experience for you. View of the falls there. Cave on the other side. What do we got? Hiking hey, backwards. <laughs> Whoa, this is cool. Behold the eternal flame. 